Imagine this. You think you've just had the most passionate, unforgettable night of your life. The chemistry was electric, the connection undeniable. And then you hand that night over to an AI. Cold, clinical, but shockingly perceptive. It takes every sigh, every movement, every pause, and turns it into data. A score. A judgment. Suddenly, your sex life is no longer just a private experience. It's being evaluated by an algorithm. And here's the twist. Those scores don't look like what you'd expect. Because when artificial intelligence judges intimacy, it doesn't care about the Hollywood version of sex. It looks deeper. And the results can shake the way we think about desire, connection, and even love itself. So, what happens when AI judges your sex life? Researchers are already experimenting with exactly this, tracking heart rates, micro-expressions, tone of voice, and even subtle neural signals. And three unexpected scores are emerging, scores that tell us more about intimacy than we ever thought possible. First unexpected score, synchrony. The AI measures not just what you do, but whether you're in sync. Two people breathing in rhythm, heartbeats aligning, micro-movements flowing together. That's where the magic lies. And here's the surprise. Couples who think they're amazing in bed often show low synchrony, while quieter, less flashy moments rank much higher. Passion isn't always about noise. It's about alignment. Second unexpected score, emotional resonance. AI can detect subtle tones in your voice, tiny shifts in facial muscles, even pupil dilation. What it reveals? The quality of intimacy depends less on performance and more on emotional depth. Did you make each other feel safe? Did you share trust, vulnerability, laughter? Those moments boost the score far beyond raw physicality. Suddenly, the algorithms are reminding us, intimacy is as much about the heart as it is about the body. Third unexpected score, afterglow. This one shocks people the most. AI doesn't stop measuring when the act ends. It follows how long the warmth lingers afterwards, how tender you are, how you cuddle, how you reconnect the next day. Couples with strong afterglow patterns score dramatically higher in satisfaction and relationship stability. And isn't that ironic? The part we often dismiss as an extra may actually be the secret sauce to lasting intimacy. Now, here's the deeper question. What do we do with this knowledge? Should we let machines teach us how to love better? Or are we outsourcing one of the most sacred human experiences to cold algorithms? On one hand, AI is showing us blind spots, teaching us that intimacy is less about technique and more about connection. On the other hand, there's a risk. When every kiss becomes data, are we losing the very mystery that makes desire so powerful? Think about it. Would you want your most intimate moments turned into numbers? Would you feel exposed? Or would you feel guided, empowered by feedback that helps you become a better lover, a better partner, maybe even a better human? That's the paradox of technology and love. It promises insight but it also challenges our sense of privacy, authenticity, and soul. And maybe the ultimate lesson here isn't to compete for higher AI intimacy scores, but to realize what really matters. Synchrony, emotional resonance, and afterglow. The machine may be cold, but the truth it's showing us? That's the warmest truth of all.